Hey YouTube, it's me guys, Zub and Ari here. How are you guys doing today? Today, bring us another fantastic episode of MLB The Show, Road to the Show, guys. Now, usually I do these live, but when I recorded this, the audio got messed up and was, didn't end up recording, and uh, that's, that's what it's going to be like for the next couple episodes. So instead, I'm just going to, you know, we're going to talk some baseball, guys. So yeah, so uh, here we are. This guy, this pitcher, whoo, he's a fast pitcher. He's throwing high 90s. I try to slide in there, just getting my uniform dirty, you know, just showing that I uh, get something plus six. You know, unfortunately, we ground out to end the inning, but um, besides that, you guys got to see this a pitcher on the uh, opposing team, the NBR, the uh, oh, the New Britain River somethings. <laughs> um, they they are quite the team. They are quite the team. Their pitcher is... He, he, you'll see here. And of course, we can't get the double play there. 6-4-3 um, double play, but uh, you know, that's fine. Score is still tied 0-0, guys, but... Uh, these next four episodes are amazing, and uh, I'm really bummed out that the audio didn't record, but anyway, guys, I'm just doing this kind of stuff, and, uh, you know, just, I actually kind of want to experiment if uh, recording, like, the Let's Plays afterward, uh, you know, seems a little bit better, the audio is better, you know, I just want to mix and match, do some experimenting for getting to continue this series, or not, and, uh, yeah, so we're just playing through here, guys, it's a little bit of a long game, bottom of the second inning, and, uh, yeah, guys, but this pitcher, this opposing pitcher, you guys will see, when I'm uh, when I'm batting, it it's high cheese at the knees time. If you know what I'm saying, it's you know he's high 90s, 98, 99, 97. I think he even hit 100 miles an hour on a one pitch or two. We'll see right here. Uh, I believe I take this first pitch uh, right here, and uh, we'll see uh, right here. Oh, 98 miles an hour on a four seamer. Oh, and look at that control too. 98 miles an hour, guys. That is not something you see every day. Boom! Oh, getting, getting contact on this guy was so difficult. And I beat that uh, that little shindig out. But then I don't know what I did there. Come on. Will, get your head in the game, buddy. Come on, buddy. He was going to second base. Come on, he beat out the throw first. He should just stay there. But nope, I don't know why, but I was, you know, I was putting um, up on the left thumbstick, so uh, that made... I thought that would make the, uh, the guy run a little bit faster. But uh, it actually did not, unfortunately. Uh, so, uh, yeah, but, uh, you know, right here we're just getting some uh, simple plays here at first base, you know, plus fives. They're easy, easy points. I'm not, they're, I mean, they're not easy sometimes, you know, you, there's like a jumping play or, you know, you need to get a little scoop or a little pick. But uh, for the most part, guys, usually whenever there's a play at first, you guys get it. Five points, very, very easy. And, uh, yeah, so we'll see uh, right here, too. Nice little, uh, you know, ground at the middle. And can we turn two? Let's see. No, uh, we don't even need to. We just turned one. Ha! <laughs> Trust me, guys, in my live come uh, when I was first recording that, I thought I, I didn't see how many outs there were either. So, uh, you know, I was not my number one thing to pay attention to. This is something interesting, guys. Look at this. Second base. Uh, we're up by two. We need some insurance runs. And that's a nice little, uh, you know, little foul. Little foul. This guy's still throwing some high heat. High heat, guys. And his pitch, his pitch count's getting a little bit up there. And this check swing. Check swings kill me, guys. I, oh, oy vey. Oy vey, the check swings. Uh, but <laughs> anyway, here we go. Uh, nice little, nice little uh, frozen rope into center field here, and uh, we score a run. And I don't know why I was signing to second base there, but I want to leg out the double because I also thought the cutoff man might throw it home for the plate at the plate. And if he did, if he threw it home and not the pitcher, uh, we would have uh, been able to take second base, no problem, still standing, and uh, you know there'd be no issue there. But hey, we still got the RBI. That's what counts. And uh, yeah, guys, so it's a 2 2 count, second and third. And a uh, nice little grounder to second base. Just get the one out to get out of the inning. There we go. That's all we need. That's all we need. And then plus five points right there. And uh, we're moving on, guys. So again, we're hitting fifth in the lineup. We've been hitting everywhere, all over. So in the uh, last episode, Curse of the Pink Bat episode, <laughs> uh, we were playing on Mother's Day. Uh, in the game, not not in real life. In real life is whatever. And uh, it, was not, it was way past Mother's Day. And uh, so, the Curse of the Pink Bat, guys, that game I went 0 for 0, 0 for 0, uh, it was not good at all, <laughs> and uh, I ruined my 28 game hitting streak, also with the Pink Bats, I, uh, it was just, oh, it was so bad, it was just so bad. The audio on that got a little bit mixed up too, but for a different reason, I got that all fixed out, guys, so don't worry about that, and uh, yeah, so, we're just seeing here more and more of uh, how, uh, how well our guy's doing here, so he's 2 for 3 with 2 singles and RBI. We're trying to get the all-star numbers up just uh, for that uh, all-star break coming up. And uh, then hopefully get promoted to AAA, Paw Sox. We're in the uh, Sox. That's what we say, the Boston Red Sox. We're in the uh, Sox system. 
So uh, hopefully, hopefully we'll be called, we'll be called up soon and uh, take over the... Uh, oh, I, I love this hit right here. Boom. Nice little double. It gets right past the shortstop, over the head of the shortstop, and uh, right past the left fielder who takes a nice little tumble. And uh, we are standing up with a stand-up double, and we were able to score a run there too. So nice little RBI. We will take that any day. Uh, actually, no, sorry, no RBI. My bad. <laughs> but uh, no, guys. So uh, we'll uh, we'll see this again. Slow mo. Boom. Sun right over the shortstop, and then right through the glove of the left left fielder. And he takes he takes a nice little stumble. And uh, it was just an overall great, great at bat. And also, guys, going back to the curse of the pink bat episode. Again, if you guys missed that top left-hand corner of the screen, or the um, all the episodes will be located in the uh, playlist in the description below. Excuse me, but uh, as well, guys, Curse of the Pink Bat episode. We hit uh, third. We were batting third. No, we're, sorry, we're batting. Um, sorry, lead off. Lead off. Jeez, lead off and third are completely different. So we're batting lead off. I don't know why you're putting a six-five power hitter. You know, not not really power hitter, but you know, he's a he's a strong hitter. A first baseman batting leadoff, guys. Please name the last first baseman that ever batted leadoff. Uh, <laughs> you just never see it. I mean, you know, right now, Mike Napoli's not going to be... I mean, okay, fine, fine. Actually, you know what? I stand corrected. Brock Holt for the Red Sox. He, um, you know, he's playing every position, though. He's not a built first baseman. I mean, Mike Napoli was a catcher before he got converted to first base. But you guys know what I'm saying. Mostly first basemen are not, you know, the most agile guys. You'll see Dave Ortiz playing first base when they're playing against a National League team in a National League park where the pitchers have to bat, uh, you know, and then there's no room for a DH, so they put Big Poppy at first base, and, uh, yeah. But you guys, look at look at all the first basemen, you know. Uh, Miguel Cabrera, he's a first baseman. Uh, Prince Fielder, he's been, he's a half first baseman slash DH kind of Big Poppy kind of role. But uh, Albert Poolhaus, he's a power hitter. He's playing first base. Well, unless they put him in DH again. But, uh, you know, this first base DH kind of role is... It, it is excellent. It's set, and uh, you know, I, I when I chose my guy and I created my player back in episode one, I uh, you know I had the option, sure, nice little double play right there. I had the option to be a DH, but then I thought to myself, also, I'm a first. I was a first baseman in high school, guys, and uh, so we won the game there anyway. I'll continue that story later on in a different episode, maybe. And you guys can see four at bats, three hits, one run, one RBI. That's how we do, guys. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so. This pitcher, the pitcher of the day, is Richie Gonzalez. Eight innings, five hits allowed. That's not bad. And we have seven strikeouts through eight innings with three walks. Not bad at all. No runs. We were able to hold them to, uh, you know, a solid, solid outing. And we were able to win 4 nothing. And you guys can see right there, my stat sheet. Two singles and one double. And, a four, you know, 4-3 ground out, sure. But uh, anyway, guys, so yeah. we're Let's look at uh, that. <laughs> let's take a look at our points here. Once uh, this decides to load, here we go. And we gained a total of 81 total points. And uh, we got a couple of good double pointers right there. Double double digit pointers right there. So we have 95 points to spend. So uh, let's see, what can we do? Uh, unfortunately, the contact versus righty and versus lefty are both very expensive. So that looks like it would be a no-go on our end But uh, you know, for this this round. But um, you know, we, we will be jacking up other points right there. You know, power versus righty and lefty. Just... Um, you know, take it up one notch on each one of those. And, uh, yeah, guys, so that's all we have for today during this uh, episode, guys. This is episode number five against the 100-mile-an-hour thrower pitcher. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have a good day again, guys. I'm sticking to the Minecraft. I'm sticking to the Titanfall, all that good stuff. So I'll see you guys later. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to stay up to date with the latest information with all Minecraft, Titanfall, and MLB The Show News. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have a fantastic day. And I'll catch you guys on the flip-flop. Peace. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it, guys. Make sure to check out the other uh, episodes of MLB The Show 14. Uh, we have Road to, the, Road to the Show. We have other games. We have just general news going around the MLB. Guys, the playlist will be in the description below. Make sure you check that out, out guys. And uh, yeah, top box of the previous video, like always. Bomb box is a mystery video, like always. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Go Sox. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.